Hi guys, what's good? This is Echo Room, and of course, it's the link up segment of the show. And you know how we bring you the best of the best. I'm talking artists, I'm talking fantastic music creators, um, and so on and so forth. And for today, it's one of the hottest artists in the country at the moment, I dare say, if not the hottest, to be very <laughs> fair. Um, her record is banging, it's one of the most relatable records, and you should check the social media platforms and see how crazy it's going with that song. I'm talking about the one, the only, Molade. Hi, everybody. Oh, yeah, I forgot to introduce <laughs> you as... The person who was famous before we knew her. Hmm. I get Why that right. Why did you say that too? <laughs> All the adverts when you do. <laughs> yeah. You know? <laughs> Hi, how are you? I'm fine. You're thank welcome you. to the show. You look great. Thank you. You look great. Thank you. You look All great right. too. You see, give them mm. dimples. Cute stirs. Let me start with this. Would you ever consider dating anyone in the entertainment industry? Ah. Man. I think you're thinking about two guys now, or two people. <laughs> That's about two people. No, 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 not like that. Okay. Sometimes when I think about it, yeah, um, dating somebody in the industry, it has its own um, advantages and it has disadvantages. Yes. And I think it, it it's not just about the industry. It depends on the person too. Mm -hmm. It's not just about the industry. Yeah. So it's possible. So it, it, it's possible, but but. Would you give it a chance? I, I could try, maybe, let's not say marry. Oh, you said date. Did yeah, you say date, date or marry? Date, yes. Date, like, give it a try, yes. Marrying girl. No, no. Man, I don't know if I want to. Because <laughs> me, I'm out there, out there. I would like somebody that can be able to, you know. So you want to marry banker? Then my craze. You know, I can be very, okay. you know. Yeah. Oh, you can be very? Mm, Any way? Yeah, I can, I can <laughs> be very crazy sometimes. So, okay. yeah. Okay, that's it. Now, um, look, man, it's a pleasure to have you on the show. Thank Trust you, me. Thank you. Uh, um, I love your music, you know, and I love your personality as well. Thank now, you so um much. let's 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 go back in time, you know, just get into that time portal and mm -hmm. go back to uh the inception of Molade as an artist. Mm. What was that like and when did it begin? Hmm. Um I started music from church. Mm. I've always been a church. Which church? Still. Hmm. Which church was it at that time? Okay, it was. Sele? No, 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 no. I, I joined Celestial in 2019. Oh, okay. Actually. But that church, I would say my, my mom's church, was an Igbo church. Mm. Gospel Power Evangelical Ministry. That's the name of the church. Yes. Is that an actual church? Actually, I attended <laughs> the church for like 10 years. Really? I think like nine, 10 years. It was a thing? Yes. Like Igbo church, my family was the only Yoruba speaking family in the church. Sorry. No, that's okay. My family was the only Yoruba speaking family in the church. So because of us, sometimes they would just switch to English when they do their Igbo Igbo thing for a yeah. long time. Pastor said, for the sake of our my member that is not uh, um, Igbo like us, uh, that is Yoruba, I'll be like, God, how did we find ourselves? And then they sing the here? Yoruba song. Then, eh? You don't want to hear when they sing the bathrooms. <laughs> Give us an then, example. Eh. Kabi asio esheo. Do we do we do we play emphasis on some some of our syllables? I'm like, how? Why? I mean, I will sing their own songs. But well. they're just being accommodating. I understand, you know? and yeah. it was really really good. Nice. They they like. Sometimes they even give us preferential treatment. Like when they'll be like, ah, because of our family that is Yoruba, mm. they come to visit us at home. They do it for every other person. But you know, when people like you know that, ah, come on, they treat me well. Nice. So yeah, that was where I started uh, music. I was in the choir. So my choir master will come and pick me from home, take me to choir practice and take me back How home. old are we talking? I think I was, say, I was... 12 or 13. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think I was like 12, 13 at that time. So you pick because my daddy was like, ah, you cannot be going all the way from because I grew up in Mushi. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was born in Mushi. So you cannot be coming all the way from Mushi to Yanokbaja to go to church for years. So he took it upon himself because he was really interested in my talent. Oh. He would come all the way from church to pick me at home, then take me to church. What's his and name? Back home. Ah, Brother Chijoke. Brother Chijoke. Do you know where he is now? Yeah, I heard from him like this year, yes. Nice. I heard from you him. You guys on good terms? Yeah, we are not fighting, but we have not been in touch. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> yes. 
Okay. So he was he was he was somebody that was always encouraging me, making me see the fact that this thing was inbuilt. It's not it's not let me teach you, it's not come and yeah, I learned, but it, it comes really easy for me, you understand? Yeah. So that was where I was, you know, grooming the talent, trying to make it better vocally. Then um, in my secondary school, I was assembly prefect for some reasons. They used to think I, 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 could I really do. I, I don't see you as assembly prefect. Ah, so what do you I see, see you as environmental prefect. Why? I I don't know. They're the clear you're wearing is clean. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I was assembly prefect, and I, I I just I just knew how to coordinate people their parts. I did not learn it, but it just comes to me naturally. And I think that was the point where I knew. This music thing, this is this this is it. I'll call it a gift from God because mm. I don't know how I do it sometimes. I just do it. You understand? So from church, then competitions back to back to back to back. How many did you I win? Won. How many did you win? Okay, let me not say it as if it's plenty. It's two. <laughs> but I won them. <laughs> yeah, which ones? Any um, big ones? Yeah, I did in Quara States. Quara Idol at that time. I oh. went first. I did not win. I was like, nah, this crown is my crown. My name is Omoladi. There's a crown in my name. Yeah. Are you kidding me? I went back. Because I'm a kind of person. I don't take no for an answer. Nice. So I, would, I went back for the competition. And from my audition, I knew I was going to win. I just knew it. Because I told myself, I said, last time it didn't work out. This time, it has it to work, work out. I don't know how it's going to happen. But it has to work out. So I went the second time and, of course, you got I carried it. my trophy. I went to. With so much joy. Okay. Now, um, paint a picture of your upbringing for me. Yeah. Um, what, what social class would you say you, you grew up in? Hmm. Um, like I said, I grew up in Mushi. One of the roughest. I mean, I knew, I knew, I knew some people that were in Mushi that were very chill financially. Um, uh, and it was by choice. I would say on the average, we're like... My family is average because it's not like we're hungry. But, you know, there are like some things that we really want that we did not have at that time. Mm. But we're very good. We're okay. At least if I misplace my phone today, in two weeks, my dad will buy me another one. Mm. You understand? So it was, I used to misplace things a lot. So it was... It was oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> it, was, it was something that I'm the only child. I forgot to mention that. We're going to get there. Don't worry. So, I have one bed told me. <laughs> so that is girl five five misplaced. Muladi was just sucking in. Why? Why are you doing this? If you you know you did not buy it with your money, I'm spending money. That is so we still buy on our own. So buy on our own. So I would say we're on the average. We're very good, comfortable. The Yoruba will say, "Ah, yo, it be your power. We're good." Mm. Yes. Okay. Now, um, uh. What what experiences would you would you attribute to um, assisting in in being who you are today and the way you've been able to harness your talent? Because obviously, clearly, you can't be as good as you mm -hmm. are now, or you couldn't have been as good as you are now back yeah. then, right? It took a lot of growth and mm -hmm. you know dedication and stuff. Yeah. What certain experiences would you highlight and say, you know what, this happened to me and I'm like, you know what, I'm going to be blessed at it. Or, you know, they bounce you off the stage one mm. time or, one, you know, all of that. Um, Everyone has a story, mm, you know? Okay. I'm a family person and mm. I hold my family in, like, really high esteem. And the fact that I'm the only child and different people would advise my dad, ah, hey, this man... You can't just depend on a female, just a girl child. It's not possible. Mm. You need to have another child, a boy that would carry the family name that would do this and that. So my daddy would tell me all of those things and I'm like, why? How? Why? Why is it impossible? Are you trying to tell me that I can't go all out to make something happen for myself and my family? It's not possible now. A man, his two hands we have, his two legs. So exactly. what, what stops me from doing it? So I took it upon myself that that family name, that they were waiting for a guy to come and carry. I'm going to hawk it like bread till it gets to that point where my family doesn't need an introduction. They know that, oh, that's this family. That's the family and they're doing so great. Yeah. So I would say family is... Your driving force. Exactly. That keeps me hungry to want to do more. It's family. Nice. Yeah. And uh, uh, it's family. 
but it's not money. Mm, well. I don't understand. What is well? <laughs> so that, so that, so that, so that, so that money is not there. Yeah. But, you know, it's family. But you, you are doing it so that you can make money for to take your family. Uh, you understand? So let's say it like that. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So family and money, basically. Exactly. Now, um, you got to a point where um, you did certain ads. I'm sure you don't quite a number of ads, but you did certain ads mm -hmm. that by virtue of it are actually hit records. Mm -hmm. This is an ad, but yeah. they're actually hit records. I was telling someone, I said, this is not our first hit record. Mm -hmm. <laughs> our first mm -hmm. hit record was um, uh, for, for, you know, exactly. you know, yes. for, it, for yeah. Mm -hmm. How was that for you being the fact that, first things first, how much were you paid for that ad? Be honest. And I don't think I want to disclose that. The actual ad? Yeah. Why are you an ambassador now? No, I'm not. But yeah. Let's just. Why? Why not? <laughs> it's, it's so I do that... voiceovers as well, yeah. right? And I've been doing voiceover mm -hmm. for like maybe, roughly maybe like seven, eight years. You know, so mm -hmm. the ad industry no day too new to me. You know what I understand? So uh, yeah, yeah. I so you know, if you sit a lot, so. <laughs> it was it was it was a good picture. Was it up to five hundred k? Hey. Was he up to 500k? It was a good pay. Very mm. fantastic mm. one. Fantastic pay. Yes, fantastic pay. Fantastic after fantastic, the ad or, fantastic. or when did you did the ad? How did you get the ad? Okay, um, my boss at that time, 2020. Your boss, how? Were you working? Yes. Mm, something like that. I was working with him, then I was signed to him as well. As what? What were you working as? An artist now. Oh, okay. It's a big job. You were signed as an artist? Yes. Okay. Then I was artist doing now, voiceover as well. Because mm. the company is an advertising agency. Yeah. It has like a record label on the side. So. Fantastic. Yeah, so that was where like those ads were coming from. But they found me on Instagram in 2020 during lockdown. I oh. did um, Dudu Care around, was it April or Challenge, May? yeah. Yeah, so he saw my video on Simi's page and he reached out. I was like, wow, you think so well? Come around, let's see what we can do together. So I was just going, vibing with the producer. So one day, I just brought this book. I was like, there's this thing I want you to um, work on. It's a rap, but I want you to put melodies to it and change it to a full song. Let's see what we can do. So all of us were all up in the studio trying to you know, make something out of After some hours, we finished it, and I was like, ah, this is mad. I said, sorry, this is the title of the song, 444. Said, well, this is an ad for, I don't know if I can mention the brand. This is an ad for that brand. There's only brand now. I can. Okay, yes, okay. now feel free. This is, this is an ad for. Express, you see, look, <laughs> let me tell you, look, express yourself. No, you know, there are some platforms. I no, know. no, it's okay. Yeah. This platform, express, bro. Okay, no problem. Let's go. So he said, if you hear this ad <laughs> on TV or radio. So it was an ad for what brand? Etel. Good. At that time, yes. So I was like, ah, so you mean if I hear this on the radio, I can tell people that this is missing? He said, of course, why not? This is it. You've done it. That's it. I said, so is that how they do it? Just like that. He said, this is a dope project. Yes, so yes. why not? So after like some days, I saw it on. My friend even called me from, I think, Imo or something. He said, I heard one thing on TV. I know it is you. Why are your friends sure having Imo accent? Actually, man. <laughs> I have a lot of Igbo friends. <laughs> she was like, good. actually, I know it is you. Like, they is you. I was like, ah, Richard, now did he, now sent me the video. I was like, ah, sir, they are playing it on TV. He said, yes. That's, I told you that it's just a matter of this. I told my dad, my dad was so happy. He was like, eh? Are they, had they paid you at that time? No, now, no, my payments would take a while. Maybe like so. Agency, six months. Two, three, no, no, it was like two weeks or three weeks. Two weeks. You got okay. your money two weeks. Ah. Yeah, it was like two weeks, three weeks. Show me the road. Where the road is not that narrow. I'm joking, I'm joking. I understand. <laughs> so he was, he was really happy. And that was like my first major achievement in quotes, I would say. Because that was like one song that I could put my name to. I'm like, yeah, that's in a meal. Well, you see, now is. this particular ad, mm -hmm. a lot of money was spent on. And it blew up. Mm -hmm. It was massive, massive. Yeah. No joke. To the point where some DJs were actually playing it, playing in, it in clubs, clubs. and we're playing it at events and people were singing along. Mm -hmm. That's how big it was. Yeah. But now you understanding how big it was, how did you cope with not being able to get the glory directly? 
<laughs> yeah, it, it's yours. But yeah. how many people do you know in person to tell that that's you? When the song is in the ears of almost 200 million people. It was, it was not easy doing that. Like, up until some weeks ago, I still see people come to my comments. So you were the one. And I'm like, how many people <laughs> am I going to express? Said, yes, I'm doing mad, so beautiful, blah, 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 blah. But at that time, it was so difficult because I had to literally make videos. Like, time it was on Big Brother and they were using it for a challenge. In yeah. I would go to the TV, like, I would do videos. I ah, this is me, see me, this is my... my yeah. I posted it on Twitter, posted it on IG. That was the struggle to make sure that I put my face to that ad at that time. There was also, sorry, yeah. there was also another discussion at that time. When it came out, yeah. everyone thought it was turning. Yes. And she actually got the glory for quite a bit. Mm. Not, you know, like yeah, book for shows and stuff, yeah, yeah. but everyone thought it was turning. Mm. How did you deal with that? Man, at first... Be honest. Very, very honest. At first, I was like, why is this happening? And that was when the whole, you sound like anything started becoming very, very yep. serious. And I was like, how? Like, I had to now start going back to listen to, I'm like, yeah, this we don't sound alike. What's going on? I mean, Yo, you don't think you don't different? sound you don't think you I sound don't alike. Think we do even till now. I don't oh. because I would listen to what she has done. I would listen to what I have done, and I'm like, what are people hearing? I'm not hearing. What's going on? So at that time, when I looked at it on the bright, I'm like, if they can be comparing me to someone on that level, something beautiful. You mm. understand? That was that was. I would say that was the part that made me feel like. This is this is not bad because Tenny is not just anybody. Obviously. She's 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 up there and they can be comparing me with somebody that's up. Of course. It means I'm a superstar. But bro. did you did you ever think because um music executives will tell you that mm -hmm. um if you if you sound too close to this particular yeah. person or you attribute it too close to this person vocally, mm -hmm. uh it might hinder your growth. Mm, I would not lie. Yeah. I had that encounter, like, when I was trying to, you know, make things happen for myself. Tell me. Tell me about that encounter. Uh, no, you, I mean, <laughs> just looking at the time, no? Oh, there were, there were some All right. people that I approached for, you know, I, found, I have this project, I have this, I have this and that. And when I, like, send them my stuff, they're like, you sound so much like this person. And, you know, the way the industry is, you can't be, like, a mediocre version of somebody else. Mm. It, it's, not, it's bad for business. And this is Tenny that we're talking about. Do you understand? You can't be a, you, I can't be a mediocre version of Tenny. It makes no sense. It's bad for business. And I don't think people will want to work with you with this kind of... How did that make you feel? I would not lie. I, 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 I was down. But one thing that kept me going till now is that statement. Still? Because I was like, I don't believe... We sound so alike that people would not be able to differentiate me. I mean, people had like these same experiences and they are doing fine. I feel it's when you let it get to you, then you don't know yourself. You don't know what you can do. Mm. At that, but I was like, no, I can't let what that person said define me. Yeah, but psychologically, if you look at it, yeah, these situations breed hate. Let's be honest. Nobody say you know the person, right? But mm -hmm. psychologically, you're like... The, the consistent comparisons would breathe. But the funny yeah, it thing would. Is me and Tenny talk. Were you talking before 444? No, not before 444. Exactly. Not before 444. But after 444 happened, me and Tenny used to talk. Even till now, we still talk. Dude. You understand? Like, I would only we imagine. We still talk. We've been in sessions together. Hmm. You understand? So there is no form of hate for me at all. She's my big sister. She's someone I look up to as well. She understand. So those words cannot get to me because I know the kind of in quotes relationship I have with her. You yeah. understand? And she's someone that even encourages me. She's like, keep doing what you're doing. I, I know you're going to go far. So how can I hate somebody like that? Someone that wishes me well. It's Definitely. not possible. Definitely. I can't. It's mm. not possible. So no. I keep looking at the brighter, brighter side. Like you know what you want to do. You know who you are. You know what your music is. Just keep doing it. And people that will flow with you will flow with you. Enjoy it. No, I feel... So, um, I mean, I'm sure that 
after the 444, he opened yeah. a new world. Nigerian mm. advertising for a while has always been on, if this works for this person, let's go and do it, mm. you know? Yeah. And then you did a couple of other ads that I heard your voice on, mm -hmm. right? And I knew it was you, Yeah. you know? Um, where did that leave your music to you? Because you were doing ads. More ads. The ads, they blew. Mm -hmm. The music never blew. Mm -hmm. Yeah, where where did that? What was your mind state at that time? Mm, I I would not if I had or let me say if we had put in like more energy to my promotions, but I can't push myself because I'm yeah. limited. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Money wise, financially as well. So I can't I can't do so much. But those ads are for brands, and yes. they have like plans to push it they're not going to use your face do you understand it's just the voice they use it do you understand yeah. this is what they need yeah, yeah. and they've taken it <laughs> and they have they have they have how they've you know they have their plans to promote <clears throat> um, the ads the yes. way they want to so they don't promote my face alongside they don't promote my own music alongside yes so it's just like two different struggles on their on two different sides I'm striving to make my music popular then I'm doing this on the side as my side also for funds. You understand? Well, so I don't think it was, it, it was, it was okay to, to hmm. eat. Yeah, to, to, to be fine. Well, what is being fine? <laughs> could you afford, a, 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 well, that year, could you afford 11 Pro Max? At that time, Yeah, yes. with the ads. Of course. Hmm. But I did not buy Did you need to save? No, besides, did you need to save? Day, of course, uh, you save now. Oh, no, as you say, they come in like them, like that. No, 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 no. Okay, no, okay, no. okay. Different okay. ads for different, you understand? So, okay. you should have used your initial. Okay, let me say for this. Some brands, they pay past the other. Normal level now. Mm. And the, the, get did your price passes. get higher? Yeah, it did. It did. At least for different Was it up brands. to a million at, by the end of 2020? Was it up to a million by the end of 20? We by know the that the price, the, yesterday's no, no, price... No. It's not, not to to, no, it's not like like right now. Yeah. You, can't, you can't you can't come to me with no. You can we can still come to you no, no, with no, ad no, now. No, but you, the we, money we, exactly. That's yeah. what you can't come with, me with some kind of amount now. No be energy, say, but you know now, that's the energy. You, come you, on, you can't just ah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, like they, I have, I have this. I have one. No. Help me. Hello, this is my red card. <laughs> yes, so let me know if we are working and if we're not. Let's go. When there's nobody, look, phones, nobody will even want to come. Now, nah, brand ambassadorship now. Now, Jonas. Yes, now the so, face with the voice. Exactly. Good. So, um, that happened. Yeah. All this was between 2020 and 2021, mm -hmm. right? Now. In 2020 still, at least you're one of the few people that, you know, had certain things to do and was actually yeah. working their way, mm -hmm. at least to a certain extent. Yeah. But I'm sure that by the end of 2021, it must have been weird for you. Because mm. it's more ads than actual music blowing yeah. up. And these ads were actually blowing up. I, some people even call me Jingle Bear. <laughs> <laughs> it's Jingle Bear. And I'm like, nah. <laughs> Uh, nah, <laughs> don't go for that Christmas song. You know, oh, you do come that. on. So I think that was part of the decision. So, you know, whatever it is, is it going to be fight? Is it going to be walking in on people? Hello, hi, how can we make this work? And that's why forever and ever, I'll be grateful to my team that mm. I work with. Mm. They're amazing. Dummy Fresh. Dummy Fresh, IBK, Toyo C, Lanre, you guys. If you're watching this, I love you guys so you much. You have to watch it. Thank you so much for standing by me. Even when nothing was looking like it was going to work out. Mm. I really appreciate you guys. See, I appreciate you. I don't want to cry. Oh, so cute. <laughs> I really appreciate you guys because they 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 are they are like the reason this whole thing is happening. Because there was a time I was like, oh my be like I don't go even record it. Let me just chill. There's another person that must have brought about comparison. Now, this person isn't as big as you are yet, Who? but the person is quite known on the ground as well. Um, uh, Rebecca. My sister. They understood. <laughs> but that comparisons are there. Mm. There's the closeness in sound. Yeah. Yes. I think the, 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 the triangle She's just a, she's very raunchy. and Rebecca. Yeah. So, I get it a lot, but I think more often than Rebecca. Yeah. 
Mm. But I believe that we are all unique. Yeah. At 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 some point, people will be able to tell us apart. Definitely. As long as we don't give up, we keep doing it. They will know. Oh, man, Rebecca, be that. Anna, be that. Oh, yeah. It just needs time. That's why I believe. Because mm-hmm. everybody is unique. Yes. You understand? So that's why I believe, sure. And it will work. Now, uh, 2022, you had a plan to release the record. Now, tell me the truth. Was it intentional? Was the strategy intentional to the, the, the blowing of this song? Adulthood? Should I, should I be honest with you? Yes, please. The only thing I was doing on my page at some point, the last project I put out was December 3rd, and that was my EP. Yes. So from that time till the time we released Adulthood, and the, yes. the only thing I was doing was covers on my page. I was like, okay, maybe what I need now is engagement. Let me just go for that. Let me set Fantastic my, idea. Let me set my heart to getting more engagement Fantastic on idea. social media. So I started doing covers. I did the first one, Melo Melo, by Olamide. Mm-hmm. I was like, ah, this is mad. Bro. Like, messages, blue ticks everywhere. I'm like, mad, what's going on? I did not stop. The following week, bam, I brought in um, Playboy by Fireboy. Fireboy, yes. That one caught fire. Even Fireboy himself had to message. I was like, ah, oh, more. This is, this is, this is working. Then the next one was, um, I think, um, I just did something short on it. Yes. Then I saw back that. to back to back to back like that. But the one that now brought the most attention was Overdose. Really? I, I chopped on just the one million. Uh, for, for that particular uh, one. 200 is my processor. 200 is my processor. Sound, can, can we check the microphone? <laughs> <laughs> <microphones? laughs> nice. So because is it the one million you used to push adulthood? Don't lie. If if it was the one million, adulthood would not it would not be where. But what I I, I bought. Are I bought, you trying to say you spent more? I did. Oh God. Okay. Let me be honest. Yes. Please. I don't know if my team would permit me to say this. Let this be the only time you say. But it. let me let this be the only time I'll say. This is the first time I'm actually, we actually saying this. We did not pay anybody to promote adulthood in a scam. Do you know who was our PR person? Who? God. Wow. We did not pay anybody to promote the song. And this is me being honest. I don't know if they were alarmed to say, and I don't know whoever does not believe. Psh. Similar. We did not pay <laughs> any single, down to radio, to TikTok. It was just us doing I think the way we used it. I was not supposed to be a full song. It was just going to be another one minute video on my that, page. Yeah. But when I sent it to my I said, guys, this is what I did today. One minute. It's still on my phone. Yes. And, and they were like, where's the rest? I said, rest of what? People won't keep me. It's, just, it's one minute. It's our just, usual reel so that we can get engagement. I managed. I said, let me go back to the studio. This is a hit record. Now you whining me. I went back. I told my producer, ah, Mr. So. This is what my manager said. What should we do? He said, hey, let's revisit it now. We went back. The song was now having a different meaning at the point where we opened the project again. I was like, hmm. It'd be like, say, and at the time I was recording the song, one person now sent me a message again. Like, can I see 20? Why? <laughs> How? Why? Why are people like this? So it was that, that pain too. I said, if you don't get now, you sabi. You know, I just, I had to, Ah, that was what gave birth to the second verse, yeah. Because yeah. somebody be like, Mr. So, let's write the second verse. So we're just brainstorming together now. Under like some, maybe one hour, two hours, we're done with the whole song. I was like, yeah, this is a hit song. But the only thing that I would say, maybe they would call strategy, was putting it out on Children's Day, that short video. That was the only thing. And that was the following day I record, I, I, I did the uh, um, full song. Yes. I think it was on a... Wednesday, then we did the the video in the yes. evening on Thursday, on May 27th. It was already like 3 p.m. I saw the video. The moment I saw the video was, yeah, never mind. It yeah. was on that same day. On, on children's, I was like, ah, it would be nice to remind ourselves, say, ah, how can I be a child? You get out to NASCAM. Yeah. That was the only thing that I can call, okay, strategy. Just hey, to be strategy. Just to put it, put the video out on children's day. That was the only strategy. But you're charting, you're currently... Apple Music Top 100 charts. I'm telling you, Spotify this, not charts. nobody. This is this is God just showing me, Lady. You've worked, you've tried, 
There you go. Just stick. But don't you feel a certain level of pressure now? Now that you're now that you're there do you know, to do you, follow I, up. I'm 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 more relaxed. Because you have to deliver. Because, because I've always been recording. Like there is no week. Let me not say day because I'll be lying if I say there's no day. There's no week I don't try to record something. Even if it's a verse or a chorus. So I have like materials. So the only thing we need to do is just I still record. Yeah, I was so going to say, thing, but with all course, the shows yeah, that you get now me, and all of that. I have features in between this period. Wow, wow. Tell us one of it. Mm. Just one. Mm. Inside school. <laughs> okay, I like have a song with Graham Men are coming up. Uh, exactly. I like that, so, but I, I want a bigger the, name. That's 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 I'm that's, sure that's, there's a bigger name inside let's, that. That's the, only one, that's the only one I can say. You get one name, what I hear from, you know, well, beds are always around well, me. Well, well. Should when I that say time, the name? When, say it. As you say it. Say it. No, I won't say it. So let's you keep have it to like be that. the one to say it. So let's 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 keep okay. it. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So so in between even this my busy schedules, I still yeah. make out time to do my recordings. Yes. But, as, but even if it's just one. At least. You understand? So materials is not a problem. I've always been recording, recording, recording. So even if there's any song I feel like at 2020 when I recorded it, it needs retouching. I'll just revisit yes, um, most and of them. Everything. You understand? So I don't feel... Pre right now, I know what the next song I want to put out hmm. already. I know the next song I want to... My EP, I can put my EP together right now. Speaking about to. speaking about EPs and next song, what is the mm -hmm. plan? Would there be an EP before the end of the year or? Definitely, there will be an EP before the end. Have of the Have you got year. in the bag for the EP? Bag. Yes, sir. No, no, that they get bag for EP. Actually, I don't. Shit, they used to have bag for EP. Ah, uh, it's me. You want to be whining on my own show? Ba bag for EP. <laughs> bag for EP. <laughs> but yes, there will definitely be an EP by the end of the year. Hopefully, by the grace of God. Before the end of the year. God helping us. There would, be would there be features on the EP? Hmm. Possibly. Let me say possibly. Because I, 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 I think I want people to get to know me and know my music more. Like right now. You understand? Because that comparison, it, it, some, it, it, they bother me. I'm not like, they bother me sometimes. But how... Thinking about the problem is not what will solve the problem. Yes. Finding a solution is what will solve it. So I'm like, okay, let me just keep doing my thing, keep putting our records. Does it bother Tenny? This is Ladi. Mm. No, I just they ask based on say not they talk now. No, you know, we don't you know. yeah, we don't even do like conversations on this. It's just I have a what's up, uh, well done. Comment on my page. Uh, thank you, sis. I really appreciate. Well, like, just keep doing your thing. Encourage me. You got this. You understand? She's a good person. I'm sweet. Everybody I love you. says it. You understand? She's, she's sweet. Trust me. She is. So she doesn't even make those things that come from outside. She doesn't make it bother me sometimes. But just personally, as an artist that wants to deliver, you will think about it. Yes. Okay, how can I make this happen? Yes, yeah, they're saying, okay, what can I keep doing? And the only solution is to keep putting out songs, keep putting out records. Mm. So people, and visuals as well. So people can be able to differentiate. But I think now, yeah, from this song... A lot of people can. Uh -uh, yes. There's a name Almost to it, there's a, yes, to there's a face to it, because I have like many visual contents that yes. came back to back yes. with the song, so... Okay. All right, that Thank said, you. Thank, you Thank you so much, so Ladi. I appreciate you. I wish Thank you all the best. I know it would definitely man, happen. Man, You're man. super talented and you deserve the world. Thank you so um, much. Uh, that's it. Next, you need to look out for the live performance. It's different. The energy is not what you know. Trust me, it is still fantastic. Hi, guys. My name is Ladi and I'm live in Echo Room. Like, share, and subscribe.